Hey guys, welcome back to another day in the life vlog. Finally able to do a quick little intro. If you are new here, welcome. Hi, my name is Sydney. I'm a stay-at-home mom to five-year-old twin boys, a almost two-year-old boy, and am currently pregnant, 34 weeks pregnant with baby girl. I am headed to Target right now. As you guys saw, we did kind of like, me and Liam did our kind of morning routine. We ate breakfast, I tidied up the kitchen. I didn't show the part where I take the boys to school and get them ready, give them breakfast and all of that. Um, I just kind of decided to vlog today afterwards. Um, but anyways, Mom. put on a little bit of makeup, just some concealer. Okay, Papa, you ready? Okay, Liam is ready to go. He's drinking his milk, but he's kind of sleepy since they woke up really early today. <laughs> I think it was like barely six o'clock when they woke up and that's early for my boys. But anyways, we are headed to Target. I'm going to get a few things that I still need for baby girl and then just show you guys shop with me or whatever um i hope you guys enjoy stay tuned leave a big thumbs up if you enjoy watching date in the life vlogs as a pregnant mom of three boys um and yeah i will talk to you guys in a little bit back from Target. Um, me and Liam are a little hungry, so we are eating some nuggets. You got some nuggets, Liam? <laughs> Chicken nuggets? Um, these are pretty good. These dinosaur ones are actually really good and don't taste like the frozen ones. So if you've tried, if you've never tried them, give them a try. Um, you guys will be pleasantly surprised. I'm just eating a few and then I'm gonna cut up some like cucumbers for me to have like a little healthy side. <laughs> yeah, puppy. yeah, I see that. There's the little Target run that we had. I'll be sharing that in a little bit. Um, but I just wanted to eat real quick because I was feeling a little lightheaded and just needed some food. Mmm. Ketchup. Ahí tienes ketchup, mira. You have ketchup. Ahí te puse. Yeah, I put some ketchup. <laughs> Liam was pretty good. He um, took a little cat nap on the way to Target, but then he woke up as soon as we got there. So I won't be surprised if he's a little cranky later um, or maybe takes a late nap because that nap was like literally 20 minutes, if that. Um, I was able to find pretty much everything, um, most of the things I needed. Some things I do want to order on Amazon because they were a little cheaper, like the vitamin D drops. Uh, I believe they were like $8 online and then at Target it was like $12. All right, well let me finish eating and then I will talk to you guys and share the little haul that I did. <laughs>
are you guys? So this is a couple hours later. I went to go pick up the boys from school and um, time just slipped away. So I did do grab a couple of things. I still need to get some more items. Like I mentioned um, on Amazon, they were a little bit more affordable. And then some items I couldn't find like underwear. I do want to get postpartum underwear and a few other things for postpartum. Let me stop blabbing and share what I purchased. I got this Swaddle Up um, Love to Dream Swaddle, which I absolutely loved. I did use with Liam. I used the next stage up though. He loved it so much, but this one is the size small and it just has like stage, this is the stage one. And then once they get to the stage two, it kind of has the little sides where you can come off. You can kind of transition them to stop swaddling and maybe take one little arm out, which I think that's really neat. Hopefully baby girl likes it. And then the next thing I got, I got some little passies, these little pacifiers. And I thought these were the ones that said that were closest to the breast, to the nipple. And Liam did not really take a passy. The only one he took was the Wubbanub. Um, and then he stopped using it like, and it wasn't all, all the time. He wouldn't take it all the time. So I am hoping that baby girl will take a passy and I won't have to be her pacifier. <laughs> um, but if your baby's your pacifier, you know, more power to you but I kind of want my boobs back a little bit. <laughs> so I am hoping to get a break with these passies, see which one works. Um, this one is called Bibs Brand. And then this is the Itsy Ritzy Sweetie Soother. I got neutral colors for these. Got two of those, see which one she likes. And then I also got a little, what do you call it? A little pacifier clip, neutral as well. <laughs> this is the Itsy Ritzy Brand. And I like the material, like it feels like it's easy to clean and like wash. Got some little washcloths for baby girl. She really didn't get any, um, or I haven't really gotten her any. I just grabbed a couple. This one came as a six pack. And then I do have like some little like blankets that could be like to cover her up so she doesn't get cold um, in her bath times. But these are so cute. <laughs> I like the colors and they are from Cloud, what is it called? Cloud Island brand. And then I got these adorable little shoes, booties, um, only because I don't want her feet to be getting cold in the colder months because she will be born at the end of November. Um, if we go out or anything, she can have her little socks on top um, and then these little booties so her feet can stay warm. Another thing I didn't have at all were, um, what do you call it? Diaper rash cream. So I got two different ones. I um, got the Dusitin and then the butt paste. Um, both of these have worked good with my boys. So um, hopefully they do good with baby girl. So I got, grabbed two just to have one like for the diaper bag, one for the house. And I'll probably have to get another one just in case. And then I got these saline baby drops, saline spray drops. So when she gets the, a cold or something, this will be helpful for her to breathe. I got a bottle brush, um, needed to get a new one. One thing I couldn't find, I wanted to get the Kamatomo bottles, which they didn't have at Target. So I'm gonna see if I order those on Amazon. Let me know which ones are your favorite for your breastfed baby. Um, I do have the, what do you call it? I did use the Dr. Browns for Liam and the boys, but I just don't want to do all the parts. All the extra parts were kind of annoying. So I kind of want to switch it up. And I heard the Komatoma ones are really good. I got some storage bags for, I'm going to attempt to pump between like nursing um, just to get my supply up. And I got the, what's it called? The Walmart Up and Up brand. This one's a pack of 50. So I don't think the bags really matter what brands you get. I got the Diaper Genie um, refills for our Diaper Genie that we currently already have for Liam. So I got some nursing bras, just a few extra ones. I do still wear nursing bras um, since I'm still nursing Liam, but I thought these were super cute and they looked really comfy for like in the hospital or just lounging at the house. I got the Auden brand. Um, from Target, obviously. 
and I love their bras. Um, they're super comfortable and just great quality in my, my opinion. And then I got this black one, which is the same, same thing as the pink one. Wow, good job, Liam. Still pretty comfortable and stretchy. And I got a size medium, so hopefully it fits. I think, I don't think I'm, I'm gonna fit in the small, so I just went with the medium. All right, so the last thing that I purchased for a baby girl, this baby humidifier is from Frida Baby. This is the first time I'm trying it out. Yeah, I see you, puppy. It's a three-in-one humidifier. It has a diffuser, night light, um, and then a cool mist humidifier, which I thought was a really good option to have. Yeah, I'm excited to try this out for baby girl. And then I think I need to get another one for the boys because we don't have one. But um, I will link all of the items that I got. I'll try to link everything down below in the description box for you guys. Um, if you guys want to check it out or anything like that. Um, it does say it's easy to clean and I saw the reviews. Most of them were pretty good. So obviously I don't like to go too deep into the reviews because everybody has different experiences with things. Last thing, baby related, I did get my baby registry gift finally from Target. And if you guys have a registry with Target, good job, Bobby. You definitely can grab you one of these. They just have samples of different things. I'm just gonna go ahead and pull it out. So I got a ton of wipes, looks like. Some Honest wipes, Huggies wipes. So these would be good for the diaper bag. Then I got these water wipes. I've never actually tried these, so um, I hear people rave about these all the time. Huggies diapers, three packs of Huggies diapers, or three diapers of the Huggies brands. I've never heard of this brand. It's Millie Moon. Um, luxury diapers, unisex, two pack. And I also got some little breastfeeding sample storage bags from storage bags, as well as two disposable nursing pads. I actually got a little bottle from Dr. Brown. So I have no new bottles whatsoever. So definitely um, gonna try it out for her as well. And then these are just a few samples. Little grape water, boogie wipes as well. Uh, I guess you can put it there. I want to put mine in here. <laughs> it's flying up to the sky. How about this? I want to put Oh, my God. <laughs> Cut it in half. 